Hey everyone, it's Audrey and I'm here with my husband. Um, it's actually a flea market day so I figured I would vlog again because you guys really seem to like flea market vlogs. This is a new one that we've never been to before. It's called the Coast Vintage Market in Mission Viejo. So I'm gonna experience it for the first time, take you along with me. Not sure what kind of stuff they have here but let's get going and check it out. <laughs> <laughs> Aptly named. It's like I don't need it, but I want it. It's crafting a couple of things. But like, this is a trinket I don't need. Like, you see this over here? I'm taking a photo. <laughs> <laughs> it's only five dollars. Would you wear this? Maybe. Take off your jacket. Cool. That's pretty well. Let me see. Turn towards me. Model it. Strike a pose. My turn to try. <laughs> Five bucks is hard to beat. I like it. Let's get it. Yeah. Where are you getting? Glenn Miller, Morris Day, and Judy Garland. Sweet. Make a necklace. Cool. It's really cool. It's like Mayan green. Oh, I really like this one. This one. Oh, I need another bag. It's cool. Can I pull it off? <laughs> no, but I can. Oh, wow. Oh. Okay, well, now you have to try them on. I think we're supposed to go over like other glasses. I'm getting kind of like steampunk vibes almost. But a little bit, right? A little bit, but <laughs> you look like a Power Ranger. <laughs> We're getting it. The cactus? It's like a cactus. Horseshoe? I don't have $375. <laughs> Pretty good condition. We just got this for twenty eight dollars. Came with the case, which I'm probably gonna use. Like old fashioned. And then Polaroid camera. So like no, like holy crap. Irvin would charge like a dollar, like a like, dollar, like, would like charge, yeah, like, a dollar. Uh, easily a hundred, if not more. Camera bag. So awesome. My what a find. What a find. What a find. Oh. Do we need another coffee shop sign? We could always use another coffee shop. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have one that says coffee shop. That's we true. Have cappuccino and coffee sir. <laughs> we don't have a coffee shop. What is this? A bench for ants. <laughs> I think it's cute. <laughs> Okay, so we're back home and I wanted to do a little bit of a haul. I didn't spend that much money, I think around $65. There were so many amazing things that I saw there, um, but I was trying to restrain myself. I thought I was gonna overspend, um, but let me just share what I got. First thing Raleigh and I are going to share is just a military jacket. I've been wanting one of these for a really long time, but I feel like whenever I see them at flea markets, they're very expensive. This one was $5 and I, I just feel like you can't beat five dollars. Like who, who sells things for five dollars these days? Oh wait, I bought a five dollar jacket at the last flea market I went to. Very excited for this. Probably gonna wear it with more feminine things to give it sort of an edge and I'm going to have to fight my husband to wear it. It wouldn't be a flea market trip if I didn't get some vinyl records. Uh, the person that was selling them was selling these three for 12. So I saw this one, Glenn Miller, and there's so many songs on here that I love. Uh, April in Paris, Rhapsody in Blue, Moonlight Sonata. So I knew I had to get this when I saw it. And then because I was getting one, I just figured I would do the three for 12 deal that he was doing. 
um, this one, Doris Day's Greatest Hits. And if you watch my Europe haul, um, you know that I got a notebook that um, this woman was making notebooks out of the vinyl covers and vinyl records. Um, I'll link that in the description if you want to see. But this has my parents' song on it, uh, When I Fall in Love. So I wanted it for myself so I could listen to it. And then the last record is Judy Garland. Love Judy Garland, grew up listening to her. There's so many songs on here that I know I'm gonna love. It's a live record at Carnegie Hall and I've actually sang at Carnegie Hall before, back when I was in high school. So it just had a lot of sentimental value for me. I'm very excited to listen to this. I'm probably gonna listen to it right after I'm done filming. Next set of things are not mine. They're just charms that Raleigh wanted to make into necklaces. He's just into that. But one of them is sort of a coin charm. Uh, the other one I thought looked like a chili pepper. And then the last one looks like an arrowhead. And they were selling these three for 10. Um, so that was a really good deal. Next up are these gift tags. And I got these six for $5. Um, an artist was selling them. He had these incredible works of art um, where he was wood burning um, scenic scenes <laughs> onto pieces of wood. I really wanted to buy one of his art pieces, but I didn't have the cash, um, but I wanted to support him anyway. Not sure what I'm going to use these for. I don't know, I feel like I could think of something uh, creative to use these for, especially for one of my videos. Um, but if I don't, I'll just use them as gift tags the next time I give a gift to someone. And yeah, I just wanted to support him. I'm, I'm all about supporting local artists. So I really want to get one of his art pieces next time though. So this is a chain link belt that I got for $5, I wanna say. I'll probably wear this with one of my like looser fitting dresses. So I thought that was worth it. I think I'll get a lot of use out of that because I love silver. And the last purchase is my favorite purchase of the day. I got a Polaroid camera for $20. This is amazing. I I don't think I could ever find a Polaroid camera for this cheap. It's in perfect working order. It's really, really clean. And I don't know, it's, it's just perfect. I love it so much. Um, the flash is detachable. And then the type of film that it takes is the SX70, I believe. And then the man that sold this to us also gave us the camera bag. And this was only $8. This is so cute. I, I'm probably gonna use this as a purse as well. Probably gonna use it for my other cameras. If you look inside, it has quite a bit of room and then it has a divider for the camera. So that's amazing. I can't wait to use this. I can't wait to use both of them. Oh, I love this so much. And that's all I got. Um, I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Hope you enjoyed following us around this new flea market. I had a lot of fun, so I hope you had a lot of fun watching. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!